My name's Michael Roden. I'm uh, the new chaplain in The Hague. When I say new, I've been here for a, just over a year or so. Most of that year has been locked down like everyone else. Um, and so it's been a rather wonderful thing to watch the church come out of hibernation and to realise, hey, here's a church of 40 different nationalities, often involved in quite heavy areas of international church life, international uh, life, areas like sort of criminal justice, international crime in The Hague, um, uh, areas like changing petrochemical industries, various things like that. Uh, one of the, uh, one of the uh, things that's going on at the moment is we've now got Ukrainian families coming to join the church or to attend the church. And it's been very moving to hear the stories that are going on, um, and very moving actually. And uh, we recently had, on the Sunday after Easter, we celebrated the Ukrainian uh, Orthodox service within an Anglican church. And the Ukrainian families have been up all night uh, baking bread and cakes. Uh, and it was very moving to see this new community uh, being part of the existing community and the existing community making them welcome. So if we think about prayers, anything, that, uh, any prayers about how we make sure that Ukrainian refugees are welcomed, supported, can find kindergartens, can find schools, can just find uh, places of life being as normal as possible for as long as is needed would be great. So. Um, I sent blessings from The Hague and yeah, we definitely need your prayers. Thanks.